The Strategic Living Podcast, episode number 335. This is your Monday Mastery Edition. I want to propose something to you today that may aggravate you just a little bit. I want to say that your comfort zone, and we all have them, is killing you. Your comfort zone is causing you to be constrained to an area that is not going to allow you to produce the kind of results, the kind of impact that you're capable of making. And by definition, your comfort zone is what keeps you comfortable. I'll give you this metaphor, this story, this, this idea. Uh, most of you who will see this video are familiar with central heating and air. Uh, this is the type of system that we condition our homes with where things are kind of done automatically. They're done based on a thermostat that is set to a particular temperature. And on a, especially the old fashioned style thermostats, the ones with the mercury uh, bubble thing in there, uh, what happens is, is that you set the gauge. Let's say you have the, the air conditioning on, the AC, the cooling mechanism. You set the gauge to where if the room temperature gets to a point that crosses the threshold and it's warmer in the room than what the, the number is you've dialed up, that, that little uh, thermostat is going to trigger the unit to come on and bring the temperature back down to the number you've selected. Now here's the key about the thermostat. It is absolutely impossible for a thermostat or an AC unit or a system like that to keep a temperature exactly the same in the room 24 seven every second of the day because obviously there's variables that are going on. Outside temperature is going up or down and inside maybe you've got the oven on, who knows what. But what, what they figured out early on was is that they could create a range. So if I set my AC to 72 degrees, What's going to happen is, is that it's going to have a, a little bit of a window between probably 70 degrees and maybe 74 degrees. So there's going to be a two degree window on either side. Even though I've set it specifically on 72, it's probably not going to kick on until it gets to about 73, 74. And it's going to say, hey, we got because here's the thing. If it was always triggered at exactly 72 degrees, it'd be the unit would be going on, off, on, off, on, off all the time. And it would just create tremendous breakdown internally in the system. You see where I'm going with this. So what they did was they created this zone and they literally call it a comfort zone. A comfort zone. Now you see where I'm going. So here's the thing. You are pursuing a business idea. You're growing your life. You're launching a ministry. You're, you're pursuing maybe a nonprofit or a charity work that you want to do or a mission that you want to do. Whatever it is. And in order to become the person that you're you need to be to pull that mission off. You've got to grow. You've got to stretch. You actually are going to be required to leave your comfort zone. So here's what happens. We regulate ourselves in between that comfort zone range. And so if it gets a little too hot in the kitchen, by golly, we're going to back down and we begin to sabotage our day. We begin to not engage in the activities we need to be doing to move the project forward. So what happens is, is that we have this internal trigger, trigger, and it's a little bit of a range, like a comfort zone on an AC system, and it's going to cause you to actually back away from doing the things you need to do to step into the fullness of what it is that God has placed in front of you. Your comfort zone is keeping you from some great things. Uh, I said it's killing you. That's a little bit harsh, I think. But here's the thing. What would it be to leave this life, to die, to pass on, not having accomplished the thing you were given to do, that you were capable of doing, that you had the, the, uh, the grace on your life to do, all because you allowed your comfort zone to dictate the parameters within which you would operate. I want to challenge you today. Bust out of that comfort zone. Reset the thermostat. Continually be moving that thing forward, 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 because you have the capacity to make a massive difference in your world. Don't let your comfort zone be the reason that you don't be and do the things that God's given you to be and do.